isn't this convenient?
you. Looks like I might need to do some uh, golden dragon trick after all. <laughs> I thought I was past this, but apparently not. That is actually what I was about to go do anyway, so I guess let's go do it a couple times. And uh, then we'll complete it. Uh, from there. I think after I think after I'm done with that, I'm gonna go and uh, free silver, and then uh, then we can decide what to do after that. Ha 
How can I help you? I help you. You know, I wonder if, uh, see, this is bullshit, man. This is bullshit. I mean, you could test this out, It'd be a little tedious. I mean, it's definitely possible. Um, probably just head out to, uh, Lake Malar and uh, fight some fish monsters until one of them casts Hydrology on you. But I'm wondering if uh, you can just put it on any weapon. Like if I can put the stonefish scales on any weapon and it will make me immune to Hydrology. Because, I mean, the armor, <laughs> as you can see, when you get down to final game armor, um, you can't do nothing with it at all. And, uh, <clears throat> I mean, we got some pieces on here. You know, it, it's mainly just these two. And, uh, if you're using field plates, if you don't have final game armor, and you go with the field plate, which is what I'm going to be doing here in a minute, after we get out of the mines, <clears throat> uh, you know, you got three pieces here to work with. But if you're using specialty shit, then, um, you get nothing. So, it's like, can I put them all in my weapons? Because, look, we've got, um, we've got several things here. I know we do. I know we freaking do. Okay, we got shock. Pretty sure we have three. We got snare, shock, and hydrology. So, um, I forget which one is which, but, uh, the mages really need, uh, snare and shock, man. Super bad. So, uh, it's like, can I just put it in the weapon, you know? Like, right now, I really want to give Sif um, immunity to Hydrology. I really want to, but I I can't say that these are going to be her in-game armor pieces, man. And I can't even say which one. Because there's so much specialty gear for the helmet and the gloves, man. I, I, I don't fucking know. I mean, granted, it doesn't matter. I could win the game with anything. You know, my first playthrough was not pretty, man. All I had, all I had, uh, was this, man. I had the fashionable helm, the Conqueror gloves, and uh, I didn't have, you know, I didn't have any uh, super uh, deluxe pieces like this. You know, I had some rubber soles and the kitten. The kitten socks. I had all that, but I didn't have uh, I didn't have an astral coat. I didn't have the Melverana. Uh, I didn't have any of the beast gear. So I mean, you know, it's completely different right now. And I mean, you can beat the game. You don't even need field plates, man. I didn't have field plates. 
all my guys um, had crappy armor, but I but I did have everybody had fashionable and conqueror, and it wasn't buffed either. It was just plain, just regular old standard gear. So I mean, you can do it, and uh, I don't know why I'm making such a big fuss. I don't, I don't know. I guess it's because. Uh, this has been such a thorough and uh, more professional playthrough. I guess I just want to kind of go all the way here, maybe a little bit. But um, I did, I did end up putting the stone fish scales onto Sif's gloves in the last playthrough, and I was thinking I want to go ahead and do that now, but. Uh, I, you know, it, it's like, the, the problem is, the problem is, again, that there's so many head and glove pieces. So, if I were to put it on either one, thinking, alright, well, if, if she gets different gloves, I'll get the gloves to somebody else. It, it, it might not be that way, man. I might need it on the helmet instead, and they're so hard to get. Like, seriously. So friggin' hard to get stonefish scales. They're like super rare. Cause I did um I did a lot of glimmering off of the damn fish that they come off of. And I only have one drop ever. And I've only had one drop this game as well, so I don't I don't just wanna piss it away, man. But um immunity to hydrology as far as monsters goes is extremely powerful so I mean it's like damn I've had this shit on me for a millennia now and I'm not even <laughs> you know I'm not even getting to enjoy it may I help you looking for something May I help you? Looking for something? How can I help you?
<laughs> oh yes, yes, that's awesome. By the way, Upper Smash is rank five. I didn't know that before. Man, that's why it's so damn powerful. <laughs> Dude, it's doing that much damage with this fucking uh, 10 power weapon, man. You know I got those more glaze now. <laughs> yeah, as soon as I'm done learning Upper Smash with everybody, I'm putting those more glaze on. And shit's gonna get real. I mean, it's not, it's not even gonna be fair, dude. Last time, I couldn't use Upper Smash. Dude, I'm gonna make this game look like a fucking joke. <laughs> This game is gonna be so fucking easy. It's not even gonna be funny because I'm gonna, I'm not gonna ruin Upper Smash this time, and I'm just gonna go in there and face Sourine, Sourine with fucking Upper Smash on everybody. I'm just gonna bash his fucking face in like it's not even, <laughs> like it's no big deal. God bless, man. Look at that damage. Almost, almost 1,900 damage, man. I, I swear, that has to be the most powerful technique in the entire game. I haven't seen anything even come close. And to prove a point, let's see how quickly I can kill him using Upper Smash. That is my back line. Like, my, my entire front line does not even have that yet. Like, imagine when my front line, in the front, with three star damage, not in the back with zero stars, but in the front, three people in the front with upper smash. And my back line is gonna have the Wisteria bow. <laughs> uh, I don't know if I'm gonna get another Wisteria bow in time, so I might just go buy the battle bow. But that's 39 uh, damage rating right there. So I'm going to be doing over a thousand damage uh, with, uh, with my back line as well. Which is, uh, which is pretty bad, but also pretty good, man. That's, that's pretty freaking good, uh, considering. So I'm not going to complain too much about that. Alright, so we're going to hop into the next video. This video is probably going to be... The entire video is probably going to be this mine. Uh, the mine itself takes too long. And uh, 
the dragon tricks aren't exactly short either even if I do go all out so uh, but I mean even though we're only gonna be doing this about three more times and then doing the mine it's, uh, it's still gonna take probably over 30 minutes man it's really ridiculous